What do you make of all of this? I mean, he's clearly prioritising. Is he prioritising in the right way? You mean with respect to not going to COP? Well, yeah. well not going to COP, mm. focusing on balancing the budget? Yeah, listen, it's absolutely essential that he focuses on balancing the budget. And we saw what happened to Liz Truss, and he saw what happened to Liz Truss, and we saw how... Well, the, he predicted what would happen. We saw how the markets reacted when we had this huge, you know, promised increase in spending with the energy price thing plus the tax cuts. It's not sustainable for us just to keep on spending beyond our means. But what he's doing is he's pandering to the markets rather than pandering to the needs of the people, isn't it? I, I completely disagree with that. Somebody said, oh, it shows that the markets are in charge of the UK. They're absolutely not. The Prime Minister and the government are in charge and the markets reacted. And they were right to react to a huge, gaping hole in our budget. So, you know, he needs to take that signal and all of us need to, you know, say we need to start sort of spending um, more responsibly. And being taxed on our spending as well, which I suppose is useful for him. But ordinary working people, as they say in Parliament mm. nowadays, mm. they call everybody working people, don't they? Um, ordinary working people want to know how to pay their bills mm. and they see uh, oil companies like Shell making massive, massive profits. Mm. So is he right to consider extending the windfall tax, which would at least make sense to a lot of people? I understand that it seems like an easy win. I think that governments need to be very, very cautious about retrospective tax grabs. If it was me, I would be looking forward. And also, rather than raising taxes, I would be looking at government spending. I think there is huge capacity still to cut the size of the state. We all know that there is wasteful spending within government. Um, it can be difficult, but we need to look at it.